Hi, Rich Farrell, Capture Manager at Panorama Government again, and I'm here to answer your questions once again. What kind of costs should be considered during negotiations? Well, uh, you know, costs are more than just the enterprise fees or the licensing fees or, or any of the kind of the, the, the more, I think, uh, mainstream ideas. Uh, when you think about ERP systems, I mean, everyone always goes to, well, how much is the, the maintenance fees and the licensing fees and how many users can I have on this? But really the cost of an ERP is so much bigger than that. And I think a lot of times uh, it's kind of shocking when people look at the totality of it. Here at Panorama, this isn't our first barbecue. We, we've done this before. So we, we kind of help people walk through that it's more than just the, the physical hardware costs. I mean, and, and it's more than just the software costs. A lot of the costs that aren't considered are the peopleware costs or the opportunity cost of not doing it. So what we'll do is we have a three-phase plan. We'll come in and do a technical fit so that you understand what kind of hardware is needed. Maybe you need an IT refresh. Maybe you need to relook at your uh, IT strategy, how many IT folks you need or, or, or don't need, or you need a bigger internet pipe to, to kind of facilitate the new system. But of course, we look at the standard ERP fees, you know, the licensing, the, um, the enterprise fees, uh, kind of the, the maintenance fees, as well as any kind of training fees. But we also do a business case for you as well, too, so that you also know the opportunity cost of not going to it. We also turn uh, each of the, the areas where we could really, an ERP could really transform your business and turn it into a dollars and cents cost so you can kind of see the labor and non-labor benefits as well too and wrap it up in a nice pretty bowl called total cost of ownership so uh, the costs are more than just probably what you see on a website and it's more than just servers and hardware and software and stuff like that there's a there's a whole uh, ecosystem of costs I think that need to be considered and, and Panorama is your uh, your trusted friend to kind of do that and uh, again we won't pull any punches we don't like to hide things uh, we will also help you think of the costs that perhaps you haven't even considered like training costs uh, one of the big things I, I think that, that is left on the table after go live is kind of recurrent training every 24 months or so because you will have forgotten what you learned in your initial training you'll get new employees or new team members and they will need training as well too and it, it's a great way to maintain that great capability that you're getting from your ERP system at a very uh, reduced rate if you negotiate it up front and you throw those costs in as well as part of the negotiations